it has come to my attention that I have not made a comedic video in over a year. So today, that is what we are going to be doing. I am going to teach you all how to write a breakup song. Now, I have never been in a relationship, but for this, we're going to pretend that I have been, and I'm a relationship expert because my friends seem to think I am. D Why? <laughs> uh, so I thought I would do it while I was home alone. Okay, first step in the breakup song is you need to look like you are broken up with, so we have to hair down if it's usually up. You gotta look sad. Glasses off. Black flannel. We're gonna ignore how cheery my background is because today I am not like the other girls. I'm like every other goddamn day of my life where I am freely and happy. I dress up for all my videos. I hope you guys know that. I go out in public and I don't look as good in my videos because I'm worried people would fall in love with me. And we need a beanie. Now this is a beanie I made in seventh grade. So we don't have our glasses. We have our sick beanie. Now it's time. So, chords, like we did in the last one. Last time we did C, E minor, G, and D. But this is a breakup song. So we're gonna add an A minor for extra sadness. So this is our A minor, and it's this boy, this boy, and this boy. If you know what you're doing, obviously, you can stick your G here, you can stick your A minor here, C, and you have to go all the way up here for an A minor. And I never do that, because I don't like it. I don't- No! It's better- it's better lower. I'm sorry. Sorry, mom! Okay, so, now that we have that, sad songs are sad, they come from the heart. So we don't need a good strum pattern. We'll get there for our chorus, but our verse, we're just gonna do something simple. So you have to mention that they broke up with you. So we're gonna start on our A minors. You left me in the dust And now I'm looking at a picture of the both of us so that's our A minor, E minor, A minor, C. So we want to do something like that because you got to have the positivity in there just a little so that way you add momentum to the song and you're just going to have a, oh, you left me line. And then it's like, I thought we'd always be together. You told me and I thought forever. You know, because you got to be like, this is forever, Ugh. you know, like, so you have to go with this is going to be forever. So our next line, we got to have an illusion. We got to have the hook. So what are we going to compare this to? What fabled romance that wouldn't make sense? Ophelia and Hamlet, because that is what a fake emo person would do. I was the Ophelia and you let me drown. I feel it coming down. I don't know what's coming down, but now we have our, not like the other girls, I'm dating an older man. And so now we have that vibe going on because we want to do a horrible relationship, right? Now we get to the chorus. So this has to be catchy because when you're writing your breakup song, you need it to play on the radio, right? So that way your ex can hear it forever and ever, and they will always be wrong, and I'm starting to lose where I'm supposed to be looking, so I'm putting my glasses back on. Now I know where I'm supposed to be looking. So, this is where we add our G. Again, you can do it up here if you want. So, our chorus, this is where we have to do the guitar pattern, which is up, up, down, up, down, up. Now we need our thing. You know, each song has a hook, but there has to be that line that separates it from everyone else. You know what would be a good idea? You know what no one's ever done before? Let's talk about rain. But you left me in the rain And now all I know is pain You left me in the storm And I thought we could have been more We should have been more But you left me in the rain And that's what you do. So, we have our sad, oh, I'm the Ophelia to your 
haven't. You left me. Right? And so, our next step is we write our second verse. So go ahead and do that now. Use the same pattern for the first thing. Doesn't matter. Oh, when you're writing a chorus, a G, an A minor, an E or a C. Either one. Either one. But you gotta have that A minor still in there because we gotta know this is still a sad song. But we also gotta know that this is a banger. It's a radio banger. So after you write your next chorus, we get to the sad bridge the bridge to me is the spot where you become a musical you know what i mean it's the spot where everything else stops and there's a spotlight on you and you get to say your feelings so we'll go with the teenage breakups i see and i only knew you for two months but i thought this would be my true you will be able to write a song and sing angrily outside your ex's house and they will listen to it and they'll be like damn i'm so glad i broke up with her but i should probably get a restraining order and then you'll end up with a court date and once you end up with the court date you're like oh great how do i get out of this so you pretend you break your leg and then they're like okay we'll reschedule it and you're like okay i gotta get out of this again but you can't because they've realized you faked your breaking the last time so you're like great so you hop on a truck that's heading south through alabama you stop in alabama you find some weird guy and you're like okay this is probably not my best option but a bing but a boom you're out in mexico now once you're in mexico you're not gonna want to stay there right because you want to get off of the continent so what you're gonna do you're gonna go down and you're gonna find the nearest boat there's cruise ships around you're gonna get yourself on a cruise ship which is gonna take you back to america now once you're back in america you're gonna get on a plane that one of the rich families took to get out to where the boat was then you're gonna sneak onto that plane you're gonna hide under the seats after someone's put their bags there so they don't really know and you're gonna move around really uncomfortably for about another five hours you're gonna keep plane hopping until you end up in asia now you're in asia and if there's anything americans don't know about they don't know about asia so you're gonna stay there and you're gonna be fine you're gonna stay there for about two years you're gonna come back to america and pretend you've been a high schooler this whole time even though you're a 22 year old who's already graduated college and then you're gonna be put in a Netflix documentary and that's what you're gonna do. And that's how you write a breakup song. Anyways, please make sure to like and subscribe. I hope to see you again.